Hi folks! Like most people, you're probably wondering when all this social distancing and self-isolation is going to end. And I'm afraid I don't have an answer, but I do know one thing. When this is all over, we're all going to want to get together. And wouldn't it be fantastic if you could amaze your friends with some drink-making skills that you didn't have a few weeks ago? So come on, please join me. I'm Bruce Deachman. This is my cocktail camp. Tonight, we're going to be making my favorite cocktail, a Pisco Sour. The ingredients you'll need are Pisco, that's a distilled spirit made by fermented, made from fermented grape juice. It's made in Peru and Chile only, but it's available here in Canada. You'll need some lime juice, bottled is fine, fresh is better, an egg white. Again, you can use uh, those boxed pasteurized egg whites. The texture won't be the same, but uh, we do what we have to. Uh, the, a, the purpose of the egg white is to give this drink a really nice froth. Uh, you're going to need some simple syrup, which you can make yourself, equal parts water and sugar. Heat it up until the sugar dissolves, then let it cool again. And we're going to need bitters and some ice, a glass, and a shaker. If you don't have a shaker, you can use a big jar, whatever. So, let's start. I pre-measured the ingredients, so uh, let's get going. We're going to start with two ounces of the Pisco. Put that in the cocktail shaker. Then we're going to add three quarters of an ounce of lime juice, one ounce of simple syrup, and the egg white. Then we're going to give this what's called a dry shake. It means there's no ice in here. Start shaking it, and we're going to shake it for about a minute to get the egg white really frothy. Now I understand you probably don't want to watch me shake this for a minute, so what we've done here in the test kitchen is we've pre-shaken one. Oh, can you hear the froth? That's about right. Then what we're going to do, open the shaker, put in your ice cube. In a perfect world I would own a pair of ice tongs, but this is not a perfect world, is it? And put that in there, put the lid back on, oops, spill a little, and we're going to shake it until the drink is nice and cold. You'd be able to tell just by feeling the shaker. Probably 15 or 20 seconds. Seems cold enough now. You're going to take your glass, coupe glass. It's perfect. You could also use an old-fashioned rocks glass. You're going to strain the drink in there. Oh, look at that nice Then you're going to take your bitters and add three drops. One, two, three. Some people like to make fancy designs with their bitters in the foam. I don't know how. And there you have it. It's one Pisco Sour. Woodsy, tangy, and sweet. Cheers.